Welcome back everyone. Wanting to get straight to our Brandon Jones. He's live downtown covering the protest unfolding there. Brandon, how's it going? Mark, since the last time I checked in with you, most of those protesters, actually all of those protesters have moved out of the Lilac Bowl. So we moved with them as well. We're on Spokane Falls Boulevard right now. I'll step out of the way, give you a closer look. You can see they're gathered right at the Fountain Air Riverfront Park. Still going strong. Not as many people here because since the last time I did speak to you, the rain has begun to come down rather hard. So now they're out here by the fountain holding up signs. You can hear a lot of people driving by, providing honks, and just cheering them on as well. As far as how much longer this will last, like I said, I spoke with the organizers and they said they're planning to cut things off around 7 o'clock. So we'll see how, how long people continue to, to struggle and uh, you know stick out here. But I got a chance to speak with a lot of the protesters earlier today and check in with them about the support they're offering. Spoken, when are you going to honor those lives? Their lives matter. Their lives matter. Their lives matter. It's awesome to see. We were here and it was awesome last weekend, but seeing this weekend, it's just insane to see the, the, the show. What? And yeah, by the time I got out here today at like two o'clock, there was already at least a thousand people going strong. Speakers were on the stage talking to the audience about the issues that are at stake. They say they've seen what's been going across the country and that they want the same kind of change to happen here and that they want, you know, this to, you know, to continue to go on. They said that although they have these protests, they don't plan on stopping anytime soon. I'm gonna step out of the way again just one more time so you can just check out all of these signs. I'm just gonna read some of them out to you right now. Black Lives Matter. Matter is the minimum. That is what they're saying. They said, you know, we're not pushing for uh, anything else. They, a lot of people have told me that, you know, they really just want equality. So we're gonna to continue to stick out here and we'll see if things start to, you know, calm down by seven o'clock and we'll continue to keep you updated. Mark. 